Jessica, I got to tell you, I have a pretty good record at picking winners on reality shows. I picked you. I was wrong. Were you as surprised as I was? Uh, no, I wasn't. I mean, I think I, I was surprised to get to the top four. So <laughs> the fact that I got to top three, I was very surprised and very pleased and happy. In a way, you know, when you were making the bottom at the beginning, do you almost feel like that worked in your favor because it gave you that much motive to like work a little bit harder? I definitely think so because it has not been an easy way up for me the whole entire competition. I mean, I had to dance for my life. Um, I've definitely had some obstacles in my way and I think that pushed me even more and made me realize, yeah, I do want this and I want to uh, work past everything that's happened. I feel like the judges were big Jessica champions, you know, like they kept raving about how great Jessica is, you can win it, you can go all the way to the end. It took America a little bit longer, but then they did, you made it all the way to the finale. Yeah. What, what do you attribute that to? Was it just like them getting to know you a little bit better as the show went on? I think so, because in the beginning, I think people forget that the first, during the top 20 until I got to the top 14, the judges were really harsh. Not harsh to me, but they gave me critiques and um, I didn't deliver enough um, leading up into the 14 weeks and then I think um, that was it pushed me harder and um, I think that it it really helped me motivate motivate me basically you know I had this theory last season where I said that like the person that you're partnered with at the beginning that's mm -hmm. how America's gonna see you now you know Valerie and Ricky yeah Ricky right mm -hmm. but but the thing is in your case that's not the case at all right because you had that. right so like are you the exception to the rule because I feel like you survived against all odds with all these different partners I really did I mean it was a, it was a challenge because I was basically by myself the whole time and I really I really missed out on Rickery or having like this partnership I mean I think but it also helped me too because I had to adjust to everyone to a different person every week that prepared me for the top 10 switching and um, I just really had to fight on my own. You had so many great routines, you know, the Casey routine, the Twitch routine. Which one was your favorite? I can't decide. I, I like that, but I'm, I'm partial to the Twitch. Um, the Twitch one was super fun. It was su also very challenging for me. Um, Twitch is just such an awesome guy. I think he's he really helped me with all the grooves and nappy tabs. Working with them was just amazing. Do you think that there's an advantage to being a certain type of dancer and so you think you can dance? Like, let's say, Jessica, I'm going to try out for season 12. Uh -huh. What one style should I, like, really focus on? I'm not sure. I think um, being able to do ballroom is definitely a plus because I feel, I don't know, it just depends if you're technically trained or not techni technically tra trained. Sorry, I'm getting <laughs> tongue twisted. Um, I think it's definitely good to have a ballet base for everything because everything stems from ballet, but also to dabble, um, not even dabble, but really work hard in ballroom and everything else because then you'll be a lot more comfortable and prepared, I think. Now, you know, I have a tradition. Every time I'm here at the So You Think You Can Dance finale, I get the finalist to teach me a dance move. So I'm hoping, can, would you be able, yeah, would you be able to teach me one? I have, like, pretty yeah. cool shoes. I have pretty cool shoes. Let's think. Okay, those two, those shoes call for some, like, disco action. Yeah, okay. what well, do you, you did a disco, right? Did yeah, disco. okay, yes. So, um. Something really quick. I don't have a lot of skills, Jessica. So went, like, up oh. with your hands, up and down. Okay, wait, do it one more time. And one then, more time. Like, your feet go like this. One, okay. Two, okay. Three. Okay. So you go. Up, down. This. And wait, my feet are going like this, right? This. Oh my gosh. This, down. this is humiliating, Jessica. <laughs> no, <you're fine. laughs> Amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.